Dark Lord knows I serve him, Bellatrix. Then swear to it. Make the unbreakable vow. Will you, Severus Snape, swear to watch over Draco? Will you swear that if Draco fails, you will carry out the Dark Lord's orders? I will. Hi, Ginny. Harry, you've been chosen. You're Gryffindor Quidditch captain. I knew you'd get it. You've not flown all summer, though, so you'd better get some practice. Come on, Mr. Chosen One. You can use my broom. Thanks. He should be around here somewhere. Oh. 
I'll see you later. Look, honestly, Ron, all we need to do is clean them out. You could have done it already if you hadn't had a fourth helping of dinner. When did you get here? About half an hour ago. Didn't Ron tell you? I would have, but you've not let me get a word in. If you'd done these jobs for your mum, I wouldn't have needed to speak to you. Mum wants to get rid of these cauldrons Fred and George had left in the garage. I'll give you a hand. Oh, oh, that one smells far worse than the others. That's it. Well done. Oh, no. Moving them must have stirred everything up. Quick! Chuck them in the pond. You can't throw them in there. Safer than washing them. Who knows what Fred and George mixed in there? Exactly. Just think of the... the fish. <laughs> well, I don't know what happens if a fish swallows love potion. Do you? Maybe they'll fall in love with you. Hermione, I love you. Oh yes, Ronald. How very grown up of you. Come on, Harry. Let's get rid of those cauldrons before Mum starts moaning. Brilliant! Wish we could do this after every potions lesson. You did cast that quite well. Great! Let's get rid of the rest of them. Brilliant. Mum would have made us clean those out by hand. We'd have still been scrubbing them at Christmas. If you just take the time to learn some cleaning spells. Do you want us to spend their time cleaning things up? This was much more fun. Why is Draco sneaking around? I don't know, but that leads to Borgin and Burks. Draco's a Death Eater! It's an initiation ceremony. Why would you know who make that idiot a Death Eater? Why else would Malfoy be in Borgin and Burks? I'm going to find out. And if I use the invisibility cloak, he'll never know I was listening in. Will he? You go on. I want to check something. Petrificus Frontalis! Sneaking about listening in, were you, Potter? I knew I'd seen someone climb up there. Well, <clears throat> enjoy, enjoy the, the trip, trip back, back to, to London, London, Potter. Potter. I was trying to find out what Malfoy is up to. I'm sure he's a Death Eater. I was wearing my invisibility cloak, but he must have seen me when I climbed onto the luggage rack. Maybe he saw your Raxperts. My... what? Raxperts. Was he wearing Spectre Specs? You can see Raxperts through them. That's how I found you. Your brain's full of them. Right. Let's get to the castle. We're probably already in trouble for being late. Although I'm worried about tripping over things in the dark. Maybe we should use Lumos. What's that? How exciting! A mystery! And we've only just got back. Let's pick it up! It's a crack. That's nice. I wonder if there are any more of them. Let's go and find out. 
I got another one. Oh, well done. That's three. That's nice. You could make a sort of collection of them. <laughs>